in the voice of a military spouse who's working the phones late at night to make sure that no one who fights for this country ever has to fight for a job or a roof over their head when they come home. That's why we do this. That's what politics can be. That's why elections matter. tonight. And it shouldn't. These arguments we have are a mark of our liberty. And we can never forget that as we speak, people in distant nations are risking their lives right now just for a chance to argue about the issues that matter. The chance to cast their ballots like we did today.
the recognition that we have common hopes and dreams won't end all the gridlock or solve all our problems or substitute for the painstaking work of building consensus and making the difficult compromises needed to move this country forward. But that common bond is where we must begin. forward to reaching out and work with leaders of both parties to meet the challenges we can only solve together, reducing our deficit, reforming our tax code, fixing our immigration system, freeing ourselves from foreign oil. We've got more work to do. But that doesn't mean your work is done. does not end with your vote. America's never been about what can be done for us. It's about what can be done by us together to a hard and frustrating but necessary work of self-government. That's the principle we were founded on. This country has more wealth than any nation, but that's not what makes us rich. We have the most powerful military in history, but that's not what makes us strong. Our university, our culture, are all the envy of the world, but that's not what keeps the world coming to our shores. What makes America exceptional are the bonds that hold together the most diverse nation on earth. The belief that our destiny is shared, that this country only works when we accept certain obligations to one another future generations so that the freedom which so many Americans have fought for and died for comes with responsibility as well as rights and among those are love and charity and duty and patriotism. That's what makes America great. Incredible daughter of his. And when he spoke to the crowd, lifting 
class. 